In change storytelling, we often try and create a contrast. And we create a contrast between a negative story and a positive story. I always recommend that we start off with a negative story and people ask me, why is that? Why do I have to tell a negative story where something bad happened, something negative happened? And a simple reason for that is that negative stories are really good at getting people's attention. Straight after you've told a negative story, I highly recommend you get into a positive story. And the reason for that is that negative stories are great at getting attention, but actually quite hopeless at motivating people to want to change. That is where they're looking for like a manual or looking for a role model to be able to latch onto to actually act and make the change that you want them to make. So as soon as that you've got their attention through a negative story, it's important you start telling a positive story so that they can see the contrast 